Hello, welcome to my channel. Uh, in this section, we are going to cover a simple button in DevExpress. And first, let me create a solution for uh, Dev, Dev, DevExpress components. Create a new project. Here, uh, I will choose uh, a blank solution. Press next. I will write DevExpress component let's create here I told you I am going to uh, create a project uh, .NET framework you can create either uh, .NET core or framework and I just prefer for .NET framework here I will add a new project I will choose Windows form app .NET framework I will choose next and make sure our framework is selected the latest one 4.8 here i will write the name of my project i will say uh, dev express lessons And now first we'll delete our form one because it is uh, it's coming from .NET Framework. We are going to add uh, a Dev Express form here. Right click on the project, add Dev Express item, and we'll choose new item. Here we can use either a ribbon form or a toolbar form or just form. Here I will just I will choose the form. Write name of our form, form one, and add it. Now this is our form, and uh, we'll be using a simple button. Let's first run it. How it is working? As well. Now uh, I would like to change the scheme of skin of uh, our form. Right click here, select skin. And here I will choose Dev Express style. Now we are changing it. And from toolbar I will write a simple button. Simple button. Now I'll move my simple button over my form. This is our button. And let me move another one. Size them. Like this. Now first let's name our simple buttons, captions and name. Here I will write BTN open folder. And from the text, I will write open folder. And now for second one, I will write exit and exit. Now we are going to choose image for our buttons. We will click here and then from image. And I click Rix raster image or vectors, which one you like, you can choose it because there are different images here. And here I will choose this one. So when we choose our image for our button, and when we choose any image, we have to make sure add to project resources is selected. If you don't select this one, each form it will create a resources. But since we want, if you want to use it later, maybe from another uh, components, so we we'll use the same from the same uh, resources. So now I say OK. Resize it a little bit. See, it looks nicer. Now for our exits, let's see, maybe this one. Maybe, yeah. I want to make uh, 
both of them in the same size. Uh, here, I think, same width, same size, yeah. Uh, mm. uh, for example, here, if I want to change the skin, we know it, how to change the skin of our form from here. But if I want to only change skin of skin of a uh, simple button, I have to go to the all properties, and from here we have a look and feel, and we click here. Now, first of things, use default look and feel. We have to set it as a, a false, and then we'll choose our uh, skin name. Let's make this one for max skin apply you see only this button is affected for example if we change any skins all component will take this uh, that skin and for exits we can also do the same things uh, but i just want to demonstrate to you anyway we double click our exit we we'll say this close and for open folder we double click it we'll say we'll give a message we have open the folder Let's run our application. Exit. Now, uh, let's completely change our skins. I don't know why it's asking this. Well, you see, it looks cooler now. And uh, let's check it from properties what else we got. Yeah, we, we can change uh, four color of our button from appearance. And this is four color. For example, if I want to use a maroon color, see the color is changed. And let's apply the same thing for the exit. And beside this, if I want to make a tool tip, uh, here uh, from icon, for example, whenever we move our cursor over the button, it will show up kind of like a message to us. So here I choose information. And uh, from tool tip, it's our text. So it closes our form. And the uh, title, I write close. Now let's run the application. First, uh, let's see when we click this open folder, we should be getting our message. We have opened the folder. Yeah, it's true. And when we click this exit, it will. As you see, that when I move my cursor over the component, it shows me the information. You know, it does close our form. Exit, so it's close. 